This is NWI Prepper 19-113 and this is uh, pine straw and this is what happens when you walk away from a fire made of pine straw. And this is not my house. <laughs> this is a guy who lives about a half mile from me and uh, he uh, took off just for a second went around the block and by the time he got back this whole yard part of the yard it's about a 40 by 50 area was up in blaze it was already going up the side of the trees and this is all just ash right here now when I'm walking on this uh, any of the needles and cones laying on it now have come down since last night but see how it scorches the tree. You can see sap coming out down there. Let's see if I can stop for a second. Yeah, I should be able to see that. Uh, that soot coming all the way up here. Anyway. Burned up a pretty good swath of the yard, and uh, we uh, happened to be the only ones home at the time. And the young lady next door came and uh, was carrying a baby and a toddler, asking if we could help, and uh, so I did. And we got it taken care of before the fire department got here. And, you know, we, we, I, it was really surprising. We called the fire department, and they showed up here with a pickup truck. So, uh, be prepared is all I can say. Make sure you got a good couple of hoses, good length, at least 150 to 200 feet. Nylon reinforced so it doesn't collapse. Have it accessible. Good water supply so you're not uh, running lower water pressure. And uh, keep that hose where you know where, where you and everybody else knows where it is because you never know when you'll need the hose and, and how many feet you'll need. It was really windy yesterday and that's what, we, what happened here was the uh, wind picked up and it just took off and burn up this yard so anyway everybody be safe be mindful of what you're what you're doing when you make a fire don't walk away from it and be prepared to put it out NWI Prepper saying stay safe and we'll see you in the next video